Hi, welcome to Packet Tracer 6.2.3. My name is David Campbell, and today I'm going to demonstrate configuring a multi router EIGRP network. I've already determined the number of subnets needed. I've determined the number of hosts needed for each subnet, which it already says in the activity right here. So, like LAN 1 will require 8,000 hosts, LAN 2 and router 1 will require 4,000 hosts, and so forth. We're going to assign the addresses and subnet mask pairs to device interfaces and we're going to configure EIGRP on the network. So what I want to do, I'm going to start from router 1 to router 3. I'm going to get the interfaces all set up, FA01, 02, the serial ports, and then the EIGRP, and then I'll go to router 2, and then once again I'll go to router 3. So let's go to router 1. And in this packet tracer, we cannot mess with that in the config tab. So it's a good thing. So we want to do it correctly and not cheap. So we'll go to enable config T. Now what we'll do, we'll just int fa0 slash 1. Uh, I should have done zero zero, but it's all right. We'll just skip that for a second. Go right back. IP address one seven two dot one six dot dot thirty two dot one two five five two five five two four zero dot zero. No shut. Well, we got ten percent. Exit. I know I could probably go to interface 00 through that, but I've been having some difficulties. And I just want to make sure I'm doing it just properly. And so IP address 172.16.0.1255.255.224.0. No shut. Okay. Do run. Z. Enable config T. Oop, config Y. Yeah, that's. Yeah, I'll be a new one. Router E I G R P. One. I just had to remember that for a second. So we're twenty percent on the way. Network 172.16.0.0.255.255.224.0. Work. I did that just so you can see that I can just hit network and then it'll be a lot simpler instead of just me typing this out. Kind of got to go back to go forward kind of thing. So dot. 32.0255255240.224. Okay, yeah. zero. Network. One seven. Oh. See how that worked. One six five dot two oh two. Five two five two. Zero nine. Dot six five two zero two dot zero two five five two five five two five five and last but not least two five two no auto to run Let's see <clears throat> okay so I put both of them at the same time probably not all right so we're in router two. This is the fun one. I've had some issues with this and I was getting very frustrated. Why did Packet Tracer not accept my IP address? I don't know. I really don't know. FA 0 slash 0. Okay, this is where we're going to see if it's going to run into the same trouble that I just had. And let's cross our fingers. IP address. 
That's wrong. Let's try 248. 248.0. No shut. Exit. P address. Oh. NTFA 0 slash 0 or 0 slash 1. One seven two dot one one six dot five six dot one two five five dot two zero no shut do run okay we're halfway there exit shutter E I G R P one. So what we got to do is work. We'll screw up. One seven two dot one six dot four eight dot zero two five dot two four eight dot zero. Not work. One seven two dot one six dot five six dot zero two five dot two five five. 252.0. We should be seeing something recognizing real shortly. 1209.165.202.0. Aha, there we go. Hey, it recognizes the neighbor. Awesome. Hello, neighbor. So that's pretty much what the router was saying, but we still got one more to go. Don't forget about the last one. 209.165.02.8255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255
Two five five two five five two five five two five five two 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 five Control Z. Okay, now let's just check our results, and I believe we should be good. Excellent. Now, what I was saying, I had some issues with my port. The FA00 did not want to take it for some reason, or Packet Tracer just did not want to see it for some idiotic, menacing reason, but. It works now, so you may have to run with that. You may just have to just see what's going on. Um, I had to just put a new IP address on both of them and then start all over on it, and it finally worked. So that actually helped me right there. So if you're running into the same situation as I did, you can actually fix that. Okay, well, this actually concludes Packet Tracer 6.2.3. Thank you, and have a great day.